everybody, this is the gear review of the Mammoth 45, similar to the Yeti, nice hard, hard design, the Yetis are like real thick right here, and yeah they hold ice for a week, but you can't fit anything in there, so I paid about $120 for this, I've had it about a year now. Only thing I don't like is there's no built-in handle. Just these straps, but they're hardy. Hinge design is pretty nice. You know, opening close is just pretty good. Nice thick rubber lining. Uh, this handle is a little wobbly, but gets used a lot and for 120 bucks not bad I like to pre-charge the cooler you know just throw a, one of those lunch pack coolers in there kind of gets it cold that way when you get the ice in it's it's already kind of cold but yeah I love it it's a uh, take it out my paddle board see my paddle boards right there love fishing on my paddle board, it's so much fun. Yeah, it's the 45 quart by Mammoth. Get them online, I found this one on Woot for 120 bucks. Got two like can holder indents. Nice 30 feet on the bottom here. Doesn't move and shift when, when you're out on the boat or the paddle board. Mammoth cooler. For the price, you know, Yetis are like $300. This was $120. Keeps ice for, did a test, you know, all day out in the pier, middle of summer. And then I left the ice in it back here on the back patio, and it lasted about four days. You know, maybe 20, 25 cubes after four days, which is pretty solid. Um, but yeah, gets the job done for easily half the price so if you see these online this is a good buy mammoth 45 quart they make the whole range just like yeti thanks for watching